what's up guys welcome to this tutorial i am cable and uh, what we are going to do in this tutorial is adding a gif image into a windows 8 application generally windows 8 application does not support animated gifs but we are going to make it possible through uh, storyboards you all know storyboards right it is for animation stuff right so let's get started we are going to create a new project blank app name it as like gif and uh, this studio is creating our project yes okay first of all i would like to give a brief intro how we are going to solve this uh, we will add a user control first of all and in that user control we will add uh, image control for our GIF image and in the code behind part of that user control we will animate the GIF through bitmap decoder uh, as per the animation actual animation of GIF okay so I would like to create a new folder for our brand new control and it has control and that control let's add new item as a user control let's name this user control as animating GIF right yes okay uh, now uh, because of less time I have already made the project so I'm not going to write each and every line of code here but you don't worry I'll upload the project and I will share the link of that project in the description part of this video okay so from now I am starting my copy pasting from ready baked code this is my code this is my control yes this is control yes I would like to go in example uh, okay I am copying this whole grid from this code to this project right uh, in that code we have resource as a storyboard named storyboard and we have a behavior as forever and yes this image control is the actual image control which goes into our user control and it is for our GIF control right okay so now I would like to open its code view this is the constructor we need not to touch it and yes here also I'm going to copy few of things not few of but everything uh, okay so this is the main part of the application right this is where the real magic happens these four regions will animate the GIF as per the actual animation of GIF okay now we have a few errors but first of all I'd like to collapse all the regions it is control M O okay so now uh, I would like to solve each and every okay you don't worry about any errors because uh, I'm going to show you every errors solution uh, this my GIF is actually the place for the name of the user control so in our case we have the user control named any meeting GIF okay so okay now variable bitmap we didn't included the package so using windows uh, here example media imaging so we have writable bitmap okay I don't think there is any error in, a, in the public property right so let's don't touch it in private method uh, yes there might be lots of errors storage file we have to add windows dot storage so we have file access mode and bitmap decoder this is the actual decoder this class will actual actual decode the image and animate it writable bitmap dot pixel buffer oh, why this error still here oh yes I forgot to add few of usings yes these two usings we will have to add it manually further let me say again don't worry about code you just follow me directly copy paste this code as per I am doing 
and uh, you will have a working GIF okay so that error must gone yes it's gone that's public event that's event handler we need to touch that uh, yes this my GIF is a place for our user control name so let's add any making GIF okay so further control MO to collapse all regions and methods now let's save this file let's save this XAML file and uh, all right so we have our user control we have our custom user control ready now let's move to our page where we want to add the GIF main right let's go to design view itself let me set the yes and here let's go into toolbox for our user control but still it's not there because we didn't uh, rebuild it let's build it and sorry for this delay till this laptop is quite slow bear with me yes okay uh, build it let's go to toolbox and yes we have our control animating GIF now let's take that control and make it in here okay so this you just directly use it as I did right now let's go to its XAML this is the control animating GIF and now we just need to add the source of our GIF into its image source property go to its image URL image URL sorry and uh, yes we didn't have the image yet let's add it in assets add existing item that is GIF I think it's on desktop right yes yes, yes. yes cracker transparent actually this cracker trans uh, transparent image is a, a transparent GIF and this is the main reason uh, that I found this trick because I wanted to use a transparent GIF otherwise uh, I, I, I also can uh, I also can convert this GIF into a video and use that but that will not be a transparent right let's add it we have a cracker dot transparent and in its image URL let's write slash assets slash cracker transparent I used to copy paste directly so we do not have any silly errors like spelling mistakes uh, cracker underscore transform of GIF right we set the GIF source and we have ready our uh, user control and so that's it all right let's rebuild it once again there is few benefits of rebuilding because it will clean the solution first and then rebuild the solution so there is no chance for any silly errors now let's run it deploy started that's the application yes 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 let's pray to god yes this is working right now uh, i'd like to show you the actual gif image how it looks so that you can clearly understand the difference between gif and application this is our gif application having animation of cracking and, uh, this is our application so it's working so this is it uh, in short uh, the main logic is to add a user control and animate the GIF as per the actual animation of the GIF right? thank you for watching bye bye